putting uh, their three pillars of what they want the company to be into this car. For one, it is design, but they're also looking at fuel economy leadership and smart technologies. Starting with fuel economy, the Evos is powered by the same engine that will, uh, you'll be able to buy in the Ford C-Max Energy plug-in hybrid concept in just a few months. Uh, where the car really gets conceptual is what Ford's done with that system. Uh, for this car, they've claimed it's a, a sort of an innovative system that will store past driving routes as well as uh, different driving styles and actually use that to predict future routes, future styles and things like that to really get the most out of the engine. As for smart technologies, Ford is using this as a showpiece of where their sync system could go. Uh, and one of the things they're looking at is being able to attach the car to your personal cloud of information that's floating out there on the internet. Uh, and essentially what it will be able to do is customize a lot of different features in the car to you, uh, be it from you know, the music styles and different things in the cockpit, uh, even to the driving dynamics of the vehicle itself. And finally, there's that style. About the only bad thing we can say about it uh, is it looks that they've lifted most of the design cues off the vehicle straight from Aston Martin. Uh, although, if you are going to steal design cues, that's not a bad place to start. Uh, there are some other looks in here, too, like the Mitsubishi Evo. And there's even some Ford Mustang, if you look 